Hello everyone, welcome back to my Royal Life News channel. The story for today is Prince Harry has lifted the lid on his top secret meeting with the Queen and his new post Royal Life with wife Meghan Markle in a new TV interview. The Duke of Sussex, who is currently in the Netherlands for the Invictus Games, sat down for an in-depth chat with US Today show host Hoda Kotib, which will air in full during Wednesday's program. However, a preview of the interview was shared on the NBC Nightly News on Tuesday evening, Wednesday morning AEDT. In the clip, Kotib asked Harry about his visit with the Queen and how it felt being back. Being with her, it was great. It was just so nice to see her, he said, you know she's on great form. She's always got a great sense of humor with me. And I'm just making sure that she's, you know, protected and got the right people around her. He went on to say that the United States now feels like home to him, despite only living there for a relatively short period of time. Home for me now is, for the time being, it's in the States. And it really feels that way as well, Harry said. We've been welcomed with open arms and we've got such a great community in Santa Barbara. Harry and Meghan made the move across the pond to California in early 2020 after sensationally stepping down from royal duties. After a brief stint in Canada, the couple set up a permanent base in Montecito, a small, upmarket seaside community in Santa Barbara, Los Angeles, which is also home to celebrities including Ellen DeGeneres, Oprah Winfrey and Gwyneth Paltrow. They reportedly paid $19.9 million for the palatial Californian pad, which sits on 14,500 square feet of sweeping lawns, and boasts nine bedrooms and 16 bathrooms. Earlier, in a teaser shared on Twitter, Today revealed that the father of two opened up about his home life with Meghan Markle and their kids Archie, two, and ten-month-old Lilibet in Montecito, along with details of his long-awaited meeting with his grandmother. The Today appearance comes just a day after Harry broke his silence about the couple's meeting with the Queen in an interview with the BBC, telling the broadcaster it was great to see her, that she would have loved to attend the Invictus Games, and that she'd passed along plenty of messages for Team UK. His top-secret reunion with his grandmother took place last Thursday, after he and Meghan flew into the UK and stayed the night at their old home, Frogmore Cottage, in Windsor, near the Queen's residence. According to The Sun, Harry was behind the Clear the Air meeting at Windsor Castle, which also saw him reunite with his father, Prince Charles. Harry contacted his father and said he wanted to meet, an insider said of the visit. The Sun reports that the Duke of Sussex instigated the talks after offering an olive branch to his father, who he previously blasted for cutting me off financially. Harry contacted his father and said he was coming over with Meghan and he wanted to meet, an insider told The Sun. Harry instigated it all. It was an olive branch from Harry and made in an effort to clear the air. He made the approach to Charles who was obviously very happy, and accepted. Charles maintains that Harry is a much-loved son and is always welcome to come back and visit. The Queen agreed to see them both but only after he had met Charles first, however, all the progress made by the couple with Harry's family could potentially be undone with whatever is set to come out in his new interview. It comes just one year after he and Meghan's bombshell tell all with Oprah Winfrey, which saw them level plenty of explosive accusations at the royals. Among the most damaging allegations was the claim that an unnamed senior royal had made racist remarks about their son Archie's skin tone. Just two months later, Harry dug the boot in deeper in a five-part mental health series on Apple TV+, Plus, which saw him accuse his father of making him suffer as a child. That is all for today news, please make sure to leave your comment and subscribe the channel below for more news update. Thank you for watching.